Well, it seems ideal for anyone on a budget flying for a fraction of the price compared to major airline companies like Air Canada and WestJet. But what if your flight gets canceled and you have to wait days on end before you can get on a plane? Well, that's what happened to several Swoop airline passengers who are now demanding compensation. Pricing as low as $109 to fly to Vegas from Hamilton. It appeared like a good deal for Erin Kreger, who booked a flight to Vegas for her mother's wedding. But what was a bargain turned out to be exceptionally more than what she signed up for. The morning of the flight, I woke up to find that the flight had been changed by eight days. Obviously, I couldn't do that. I would have missed my mom's wedding. I couldn't take a flight that was eight days later. As soon as I got that email, I rebooked um, with WestJet. And that ended up costing her an extra $500 on top of her initial flight costs with Swoop. Since I returned from Vegas and complained to the airline, I haven't received any response, any acknowledgement for the inconvenience that happened. Nothing, just no response whatsoever. Craiger says it's been about a month of silence from Swoop, an airline that's no stranger to customer complaints. According to the Canadian Transportation Agency, in July, there were 50 complaints filed against them. That number has increased substantially to 148 as of September 9. They say, however, not all those complaints are related to cancellations alone. They have still not received any kind of response from a company with a legitimate complaint is very concerning, that they haven't offered anything, a voucher, n nothing. What I'm looking for is a full refund, but they haven't even apologized. The federal government rolled out its air passenger protection regulations, setting out what compensation airlines must pay for failing to provide adequate services, with regulations related to cancellations set to take effect December 15th. Airline passenger advocates say that will make situations like Kreger's difficult for the passenger. What do passengers need to know that are dealing with this? Who will likely argue that it owes nothing to passengers because those were uh, cancellations either outside of their control or they will argue it was necessary due to maintenance issues and under the new rules they would be off in those situations to a great extent. Uh, they will also state that they don't have to rebook passengers on flights of other airlines because they are a small airline and that's an interesting argument because although they are not transport as many passengers, they are owned by WestJet. Now, Lucas advises passengers dealing with similar issues to consider small claims court. We reached out to Swoop Airlines. They say they had all available resources working to get travelers to their destinations as quickly and safely as possible.